And since it, it is morning show for this day, we thought we're going to jump up on that opportunity and at least share some of our favorite moments of what it's like to wake up every single morning for your feel good breakfast show. So, Kat, you're up first. So, let's take a look. Serious. <laughs> Hi, I'm Gata Khamaboy and I've been a host on Expresso Morning Show on SABC3 for eight years. When I started eight years ago, it was very little because I really had no idea uh, what would be going on, at least in terms of what it looks like on TV when you have a live setup. And that first day, man, was as, <laughs> as rocky as you could ever imagine a first day, first team running a live production. I think since then it's just been such a fun journey connecting with South Africans every single day. What has changed for me since those uh, formative days of my live TV broadcasting career, I think is I've learned to accept myself a little more, uh, a lot more in fact, for, for who I am, the bubbly person that I am that I think in the beginning I received a lot of criticism for because it used to annoy a lot of people. Um, but I've also accepted that that is one of my strengths. I do uh, want to be a force of positive energy out there in people's lives. We live in tragic times in many ways and we have a way and a manner of putting smiles on people's faces, but I don't mean just smiles that last for a second. We have a unique opportunity to be able to inform those conversations that people have at breakfast. When those first thoughts of the day are forming, when you're picturing how you want your day to turn out. So I think one way I thought that it gets easier over the years to wake up early in the morning, but I think it's the reverse for me where in the beginning, but obviously we had the show that started a lot earlier, but I used to be up at like 2 o'clock, 2.30 in the morning, literally just out of pure excitement. And then you realize that <laughs> if you do that for too long, your adrenal levels are peaking at the wrong time. So you need to kind of manage your sleep. But other than that, this job is such a pleasure that there are very few challenges. That, and that if they are, for me, I don't know, I kind of overlook them and just look at the, the abundance of joy that exists in the studio between the crew, the presenters, and everyone, the guests, everyone that comes in here every, every morning is like, I can't believe you guys are so energetic. Like, how do you do it? And it's, it's just part of the spirit of what Expresso is all about. So to all the morning show hosts all across the world, I wish you all a happy International Morning Show Host Day. I can't believe it. We have our own day. Truly wonderful. Thank you for the work that you do in enriching the lives of so many people and your viewers that watch every single day. And to our Expresso fam, it's always love. Thank you so much for the support over an incredible eight years. And here's two more years to come. It's incredible to look back at some of those moments and you realize how much fun we actually have. And we need to point out, Katlejo and you, Ewan, are some of the OGs. You've been here since the very yeah. first day we that Espresso broadcast. Eight years. Eight years. Now it's been a phenomenal journey, but it's, it's going to be cool. We're going to be taking a look at those little trips down memory lane throughout the course of the morning from all of us because we are such a phenomenal team and we all love each other. We're like family, man. But oh. one more round of applause for my man, Katlejo.